While spirits are still high in Little Rock, Parkview just five months removed from winning their first football state championship since 1978. But the Patriots are already flipping the page to 2023, back to beating the heat here at spring practice to gear up for the fall at War Memorial Stadium. Once you win one like, like we did this past year, kids get hungry again. It's been a, it's been a good spring for us so far. You, know, you can tell that they're eager to get back out on the field and you know, start doing the things if we you know, pick up where we left off last year. That's kind of what we're hoping. Got some good seniors, um, expecting really good leadership from this group this year like we had last year. And once you've tasted it and you've been there, whether you win it or not, you want to be back into it again, and, and, and they already know what the expectations are. They know what we expect from them every day because we're real demanding. Everything from the, your shoestrings coming untied. Little things are what help you win games, and you know that's something that we've been preaching, but we hadn't had to do a whole lot of preaching because they've, they've really grasped that concept and ran with it. Parkview enters spring ball on the heels of that historic 31-21 win over Shiloh Christian in the 5A state final. The team also earning their first outright conference championship since 1984. Coming off his own first career state title, Brad Bolding says that success motivates his Patriots to come back for more. If you want to have a program, a real program, that needs to be your ultimate goal each year is to try to raise the bar again. I mean, that's always difficult because you have to have some luck and you got to stay, have, not have many injuries to key players. And so, you know, they know that we've, you've got, we've got to come out here every day and, and look to get better. No, no drop off. The pressure's on some of our guys, that, you know, and they kind of, we try to put a little sense of urgency on it. And so they know that it's, it's coming and you got to be ready to play and, and We'll get a taste of it this summer against Bryant and Conway and a lot of those big schools. On paper, the Patriots are well positioned to run it back, returning top skill position players like star wideout Material Elston, state finals MVP quarterback Eric McGee, and the quarterback of their defense, four-star Razorbacks target, safety Amarion Robinson. Parkview will use spring practices through May to fill other holes left by graduates and get ready for their chase to repeat. You know, we've got holes to fill. I mean, obviously, when you win a state championship and you graduate guys, you're going to have to fill some key spots, some guys that are really good leaders. So we got two good defensive linemen that we're really excited about. We lost our two ends, and they were really, really good. So that'll be a hole we'll have to fill and some corner positions on defense. And, you know, a, a little bit, just a little bit of depth on the offensive line. We've got to develop that during the summer. But I think we will. We'll be at team camps all summer. We'll host three, and then we go to Bryant, and we go to – Conways and, and so we'll be busy this summer.